Hey guys, welcome to Led by God Ministries. My name is Hanifa. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Welcome, welcome, welcome. To those that have not subscribed, please hit the subscribe button, notification, like, and, and comment, okay? Um, for those that have been hanging with me, thank you guys so much for your dedication. I really appreciate it. I really do appreciate it. Now, I was in prayer and I was in the presence of the Lord. And the word that came to me today is, um, is don't forget God when he comes through with his promises for you you know a lot of times like we'll be in in places where we remember his name when we're going through hard times and we call out to his name and we yell his name out and we know him then right but then it's like when God blesses us you know with the promises that he's he's blessed us with, with wonderful great wonderful things that he has for us um, we tend to forget his name we tend to forget him we tend to turn our backs on him but remember, remember the days of the struggle, how you called his name out. Remember the days of the tragedies, how you called his name out. You remembered him then. You remembered him at the time when you had nothing. You know, you were either homeless or you just had nothing, you know. Um, and you can recall how you remember who your Heavenly Father is. You, um, it seems like we always tend to remember our Heavenly Father when we have nothing. But when He blesses us with something or with many or plenty, we tend to turn our backs and forget who He is. And God is saying, do not forget about Him. Do not forget Him. Do not forget His name. Do not forget where He brought you from, okay? All of it was a lesson. All of it was a test. All of it was to see if you were going to break, if you're going to fall back, if you're just going to give up, and so on and so forth. But He brought you through. He reached His hand out to you. And he pulled you out of the struggle. He reached His hand out to you. And He pulled you out of that, that wilderness. He reached His hand out to you. He He pulled you out of the area where you were just you just threw in the towel and you said enough is enough I give up and he showed up and he showed out God loves to show up and he loves to show out especially when you throw in the towel okay and that's not to say just throw in the towel and God's just gonna show up God is there he's always been there with you and he's always been walking you through every struggle that you've you've gone through he's never left you he said i will never leave you and i will never forsake you okay so with that being said you guys listen god is about to do some wonderful and great things in each and every one of our lives um be receiving to this word and be receiving to the gifts and the promises that god has for you but remember do not forget who your heavenly father is throughout the blessings that he's about to pour out on your life, throughout the gifts that he's about to gift you. Do not forget that it came from your heavenly father. It didn't come from man. Yes, God works through man on your behalf, but God is God and it all comes from God. So don't forget who God is and what he's blessed you with. And sometimes what God will do he'll throw in a little extra you know what i'm saying just to show that it was him you know not only the things that you ask for but a little something extra you kind of get where i'm coming from because he's god and he wants everything for us he wants us to know that everything belongs to us because of him you know so anywho god's about to do some great and wonderful things in each and every one of our lives be receiving to the word be receiving to the gifts to be receiving to the promises god is good he means he wants the best for each and every one of us but he doesn't want us to forget and sometimes it takes us long because It, it, he, Holy Spirit is taking me back to the wilderness. You know, when the um, Israelites were in the wilderness, um, how they went around in circles in the same place for 40 years. They went in the same place, around in circles in the same place before God can give them the, um, the land with milk and honey right God gave that was a promise the land of with milk and honey but not everyone ended up going not everyone yeah <laughs> yeah 
he will cut off thank you holy spirit he will cut off some yes he said the, okay for the answers he said the descendants will go and they'll receive the the uh the lamb with milk and honey but um god's promises is promise promises are his promises he does not know how to fail um he doesn't know how to fail and his words will never return to him void okay when he says he has a promise for you he has a promise for you when all the time that you've been praying and everything and asking it's it's about to just pour out okay so listen guys oh don't forget oh jesus thank you holy spirit do not forget who your heavenly father is do not forget him he's beautiful he's great and he wants the best for each and every one of us but do not and i say this sternly do not do not do not forget who your heavenly father is and where this is coming from okay this is only coming from your heavenly father it can only come from your heavenly father it can only come from the spirit of god it can only come from our heavenly father it can only come from our heavenly father in jesus mighty name in the name of jesus Ooh, ba, 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 rohiara. Mm, thank you jesus thank you holy one thank you holy spirit i love you guys god bless you guys but remember please whatever you do do not forget your heavenly father and what he does for you i love you guys god bless you guys and thank you guys so much for tuning in with hanifa at led by god's ministries this is his ministry i just work for him god bless you guys bye bye